do you do? Uh, what's your name and where do you work? Okay. Uh, my name is John Burkhart. I'm the uh, founder of Real Time Content Lab. Can you explain the role of a content strategist? Um, I can. So let's say um, we go into a kitchen and we throw a la around a lot of ingredients and the kitchen gets really, really messy. Uh, and then we have a knock on the door and you've got guests over for dinner and you're like, uh, we just got lots of ingredients around here, uh, but I'm sure you can find something to eat. So that is the current state of content. What a content strategist does is they provide a recipe um, based on their experience of, of what tastes good. And it, it is, without a content strategist, you are cooking without a recipe. And you can be creative in a lot of different, you can just be haphazard in a lot of different sort of fields, but you know, cooking you can't, and with content you absolutely can't. You, you have to know who you're talking to and uh, where they are, what their hopes, dreams, uh, likes, loves, uh, what, what, what they live and breathe. Uh, and you have to uh, know how, what platforms they're on and how to best reach them. Great. Uh, and why do you think content is such a big topic at the moment? Why do you think it's so hot in the industry? Uh, I think the industry likes to have a buzzword. Social media was the buzzword of a few years ago. Content is now the new one. Uh, and we like latching on to things. My, my personal uh, thing that I'm going to uh, abandon and put into Room 101 is real-time marketing, uh, which I've been involved in from the beginning. But content is big because people have found a label for all the different sort of words, pictures, uh, and videos, different ways to reach people. So everyone's freaking out about how to get people's attention because people don't live their lives for brands and so people are finally realizing that. So now we've put this content and content strategy, all these labels, and the smart brands are actually figuring out what people want and finding ways to uh, reach them in an authentic way. Great. Uh, what do you think the key skills are and the attributes to succeed as a content strategist? Uh, I think the, I actually think the key skills of how to survive as a content strategist um, are similar to the ones in my former career as a copywriter because curiosity um, and uh, interrogation, like being able to, why are we doing that? Because I, I think brands get caught in these traps because they're not asking why are we doing that? Is that human? Would people really do that? Do people really want a branded app? How many banner ads have you ever clicked on? But this kind of like questioning ability to just basically call foul on everything that doesn't make sense is what a content strategist does. And I think the good creatives do the exact same thing. It's just a focus on the recipe rather than the, the, than the finished meal. Cool, um, okay. What keeps you fresh, current and inspired? Uh, I think the thing that keeps me fresh um, is it, probably a variety of things. I don't think, uh, yes, I could tell you about my 4,000 RSS feed, my blogs that I read and, and Twitter and, you know, all of these, like my iPad is full of stuff, but uh, it's, it's a combination and will always be, just like content is always a combination of things, uh, and that is a combination of real life meetups with people that are a lot smarter than me and keeping up on all of my sources, but definitely moving outside of the advertising industry uh, and not just focusing on advertising blogs, because that is a good way to just do what everyone else has done before. Exactly. Uh, all right, and finally, uh, what's the next step in the career for you? Where do you go from here? So I think for me, the next step uh, is to really help brands and more particularly uh, the C-suite, the CEOs, the CMOs, really figure out a way how to organizationally restructure to be able to reach people where they are. And I think there's a lot of exciting things happening in retail with iBeacons. Uh, there's, there, there's, there's so much out there to, to help lead us back to what the people want. And I think if I could help the C-suite through my workshops, uh, really start to understand what it takes to shift a big organization or even a small startup 
then uh, I'd, I'd be happy. Great. Thank you very much. Cool. Cheers. Thank you. Source LF are London's leading creative communications and media recruitment agency. Be sure to like our video and subscribe to this channel. Take the moment to watch another of our videos on screen now.